Senator John Kerry and dozens of Massachusetts residents packed the State House Wednesday, hoping to convince state lawmakers that the late Edward Kennedy's vacant Senate seat needs to be filled immediately. Before he died last month, Senator Kennedy asked Massachusetts officials to allow Governor Deval Patrick to name a temporary senator until voters choose a permanent replacement in a January special election. We feel very strongly that that's something the state needs for its economy and for the jobs in this state. A lot of things are going to be discussed in this fall session of the U.S. Senate that will very directly affect the state's uh, jobs and economy. For example, the health care reform. Naming a replacement right away will give Democrats a filibuster-proof majority in the Senate, which they'll Mr. probably Bennett need to get health care reform through Aye. Congress. Republicans are calling the push to change the rules a power grab. But the reality is, is we know what's going on here. This is all about Washington politics. This is about getting the 60th vote so we can ram through health care reform. And I just think that, in my opinion, it's the wrong thing to do. Massachusetts law currently bars the governor from naming congressional replacements or making temporary appointments. The measure was crafted just five years ago when Senator John Kerry was the Democratic nominee for president. Sandy Kozell, The Associated Press.